<laughs> hey guys, welcome back to the vlog. I actually started vlogging a little bit already. Today, so I'll insert that footage here in a second. But we are, um, we did a little day trip to Greensboro, North Carolina. Um, we're actually gonna meet up with Ken's parents later and have some dinner, but we decided to just come out here for the day. It's a really pretty Friday, and we're actually pulling up to the Children's Museum, which is basically just like kind of a big kids play place it looks like it's so cute now that cole can walk and like really play with things i think it's gonna be like right up his alley so we took the drive here right during cole's nap time he passed out so he slept the whole entire way and then woke up like four minutes before we got to the restaurant so the timing was literally impeccable and then we grabbed some lunch at this place called bites and pints i believe we got these like loaded tater tots they're called like kitchen sink tater tots they were crazy but they were really good and then we got like a bang bang shrimp po boy and um like this chicken and waffle but it had like eggs and bacon and cream cheese and honey mustard and it was kind of a crazy combination of stuff but it was insane so i will insert whatever other footage i have to show y'all from lunch <laughs> coley and i are matching twins <laughs> yummy on the look he was so hungry <laughs> yeah coley up to the children's museum and we're gonna go check this out and then um, probably go to a little park do a little more playing probably some walking around enjoying this weather it's like 70 degrees so it's just like perfect um, yeah you want to get out so it'll be a nice day to spend some time outside and then we'll grab dinner I'll also insert some pictures of Cole and I we just did like a little quick photo little session because we're kind of matching but like also not really matching we did like a very subtle matching moment and we got some cute pictures so I'll insert those are you ready to go Cole, are you ready? I'm ready. Okay, let's go. I'll go. <laughs> let's go. I'll go. Okay. Here's my little outfit. I guess you saw the photos, but I have a little dress moment, a little matching flannel, and then my little high top sneakers in the diaper bag. Yeah. Have you checked this diaper? <laughs> cool, you're too obsessed with balls. You want to try something?
You see the cars? Wow. Wow. Oh, you want to see the truck? And the mail truck. Nice, Coley. Eat it. Don't eat it. No, no. Hey. Yucky. Okay, Coley. Ready? Coley. We sent Cole down that slide by himself and he actually did pretty well. He went down like on his belly, like feet first, and he, he didn't like it, but he didn't hate it. So that was good. I see you. Oh, I see you. <gasps> Look, they're coming to say hi to you. They're so, oh, oh boy. We are so tuckered out <laughs> from that. We were in there for, how long were we in there for? Over two, yeah, just over two hours. It's been two and a half hours since we got here. We are gonna go walk around. There's like this cute little park across the way. So like we're gonna just take a little bit of a break from all the simulation and just walk around, take like a leisurely stroll. It's like so pretty out and we were inside pretty much the whole time, but this place is so cute, it's so cool. I feel like for toddlers, but also like definitely for older kids, like probably up until like 12, you, ready, buddy? you could be into this. So, I mean, it was fun for us, even as parents, but it was exhausting. How tired are you? Hey, I'm tired. <laughs> like we cannot keep up. That lane right there, like in the middle of the road, is parked cars. I don't understand that. Why would you have that? We're walking oh, through the city. Oh no! This car clearly just, it's like a three car situation. This park is so cute. It's got like a big play area in the middle for kids, which we're gonna like Cole go into in a little bit. But they have this like little cafe area with these two different little shops. And then the like performance center is right there. How you doing? Are you sleepy? Do you want to go Nana? Are you tired? Yeah. Um, that whole car accident situation was kind of wild. We clearly must have just missed that happening because it had just happened, but we didn't even hear it. We were like a block away, so I don't know how or when that happened, but people were screaming and like kind of causing a scene and it, the cars were like all piled up. The one car was like leaking gas. It was kind of a sketchy situation, so we got out of there, but. Nice. Uh oh. Baby, yeah, baby. Just the food and holler and best thing ever. You want to go up there? Spins, cool. Whoa. Nice. Whoa. Nice. Cooly. <laughs> uh oh. Uh oh. 
we have a little bit of time to kill before dinner. So thankfully, um, these little like bracelets allow you to come back in here like all day long at the Children's Museum. So we chilled a little bit and now we're back in here and we have to leave for dinner in like 15 minutes. So we figured we could get a little more energy out. Go, go, go. Nice. Uh-oh, try again. Nice! <laughs> He's like waddling so fast. Oh, there goes that. <laughs> nice! No, all done, all done, all done. Yeah, all done. This kid almost looked like he was gonna fall asleep at the dinner table. He like, put his head down on the table while we were eating. Uh, we met up with my in-laws for dinner, which that place was like, eh. Like it wasn't bad, but it wasn't like amazing or anything like that. But um, he looked so tired, <laughs> literally had his Uncrustable like in his face as he was like laying on the table and he's not the kind of kid that really like gets tired spontaneously like that So Ken thinks he was like actually about to fall asleep. I don't think he was but he just seemed so tired But then of course we have This hour and a half ride home No, all done. All done. Yeah, sorry All done. He's saying please 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 because I put on the um, iPad for him to watch on the way home Yeah, we gotta go now and I Oh no, oh no. So of course he's falling asleep at dinner and then in an hour and a half drive. No interest in falling asleep. And it's already past your bedtime. It's past your bedtime. You need to go nine. Yeah, but I'll done with the show. I'll done. I'll done. Yeah, time to go nine. <laughs> I'm looking for my phone. My contacts are so so annoying right now. The lighting in here is fantastic. Oh my gosh, you know what was the sweetest thing? The waitress at the place we went for lunch was like, oh, did you do your hair yourself? And I was like, I did. Thank you for asking, that's so sweet. But anyway, um, we are obviously home and Cole <laughs> went right to bed. Of course, honestly, I could go to bed right now. I feel like the things that are like crazy stimulating for kids and just exhausting are honestly like, equally as stimulating and exhausting for the parents that are like doing the supervising and the playing and the orchestrating and the running them all over the place in the car and all these things. So I'm literally pooped. I feel like Ken and I are gonna pass out. It was a long day. Cole was so tired, but we had a lot of fun. We just went for like kind of the second half of the day and got to meet up with Ken's parents and have dinner, which was really nice. We don't really like get to like meet up with them kind of casually. It's usually like a big kind of scheduled thing. So that was really nice. And of course I got excited to see Cole and Cole was so excited to see them. He calls them Nana and Pop Pop. So the whole time he's like, Nana, Pop Pop, Nana, Pop Pop, like looking forward to seeing them. So it was really cute. We had some good food and just a lot of fun. It's so exciting that Cole is of the age and like the physical capabilities now that he can like walk and stuff to go do things like that. Like for the longest time he obviously could only crawl so things like that wouldn't really have made sense. But now that he can like walk around and toddle and like actually play with stuff and get excited about things and he loves playing by himself too so he's able to just kind of go around and explore. It's so much fun getting to watch him and play with him and stuff and it's just a cool way to get to like spend our time now rather than you know having to do things that involve him being like in a car seat or a stroller or something like that so we had a really fun day definitely recommend if you were in the area or you know somewhere around North Carolina to take a little trip there I know a lot of places have like kids museums like that but that's the first one we ever went to at least with our own kid so it was a lot of fun and I'm happy I got to vlog it so I hope that y'all enjoyed this video thank you so much for watching if you would like to subscribe we'd love to have you we have so much fun here and until next time I will see y'all in our next video bye guys